Hey guys, what's up? My name is Justin Bashirs, and I'm out here in front of the Davy Crockett Towers where I just had an in-person hearing with the Board of Parole. Uh, this was my uh, opportunity to share with the board how I've changed my life and ask for their recommendation for a full pardon from the governor. And so I'm happy to report that I had a lot of people show up. A lot of people wrote support letters. Uh, my man Mike Sparks came out, gave his testimony um, of needing more advocates. And so I'm happy to report that they gave seven yeses of recommendation uh, for a full pardon of my felonies. And not only that, five, five asked for an additional pardon for a misdemeanor charge as well. So yes. I'm super excited about where we're at in the journey. I got a long way to go, but this was an important step and I'm happy uh, that you guys are praying for me and a part of this process. So anyways, uh, we're, we're not done yet, but that was a big first step. Again, I'd like to thank Representative Sparks for coming out here and supporting me, sharing testimony and uh, and just being a part of this Wait, journey. Troy. So anyways, yeah. love thank you Thank you, we got Troy here. Why'd you come up here, Troy? You drove all the way from Smyrna. Come up here and help your buddy Justin. You know, it's, uh, it, it's, it was an honor to come today to, to celebrate this man. If uh, you know, I, I met him randomly four years ago, and he has taught me how to have a relationship with Jesus Christ, and that's a blessing. Yeah. You cannot yeah. replace that with anything. Yeah. Tell me, get a quick a review of the of the barn. How y'all met? We At met. the old Britain barn, right? We met through the old Britain barn. I was we're looking for some of that wood, and he had permission to get it. Yes, yes, <laughs> And our yes. story's grown from there. Yes, yes. exactly. Well, the, your beautiful wife, what's her name? Her name's Jessica, and she is not going to be in a video. Oh, she don't be in no a video. <laughs> Will you say a word or two? You know, no, two. That's, she's not that, That's do fine. It. Yeah. Well, let me ask you, you've, you've yeah. got four foster kids, is that right? Absolutely. Why do you do that? Well, uh, my wife first felt a draw in her heart to help uh, kids and also give them a second chance. But also, if pa sometimes parents need a second chance yeah. too. Yeah. And um, th they may have been down their luck or something happened. And so we wanted to provide an opportunity for kids and parents to have a second chance. Well, um, yeah, our state, I was saying at the hearing, our state has about 8,000 kids in, in, in custody. In, yeah. in, just Department of Children Services now that we're looking for foster homes. A lot of folks may not step up like you have. Uh, what do you tell other folks that may be in your situation that got in trouble when they were 17, 18, 19, 20, you know, that are looking for a hope? Maybe they're yeah. 25, maybe they're 30 that, 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 that were convicted years ago. What do you want to give advice to those guys just, and, and, ga and gals? Yeah, just keep doing the next right thing. You don't have to try to get it all back at once. Just keep doing the next right thing. Yeah. Um, I, and that may be different for each uh, and every situation. I'll just take it one step at a time, one day at a time. And, uh, and and like I said, just keep doing the next right thing, whether that's taking the right job, getting away from the wrong people that you're in, yes. uh, getting into a positive support community. Um, uh, you know, whatever that next thing is, just do that and keep doing that. Yes, yes. Well, I'm, obviously the board was impressed with you. Uh, the former Senator May Beavers is on there, Barrett Rich that I served with, uh, Richard Montgomery I served with, I think there's Mr. Duncan, don't really know him, and there was uh, uh, another gentleman, do you remember the name? Uh, Falcon. Falcon, yeah, and uh, and I think there was a, a Miss Kustoff mm -hmm. that just came on the yes. board. But they've really seemed touched by your story. Um, not everyone has a support network that right that Justin Bashir had here today. You right. probably had the biggest crowd that they've ever had up here. Really? And it mattered. Yeah, every seat was full and they were impressed with the with the turnout. Um, but I know it, it, it I know it matters to you, but it's also gonna make a difference in other people's lives. So thank you, brother. I appreciate you man. Thank you.